<laughs> I want to be somebody's god doctor on this YouTube because I need to have a mentor, I need to have a godfather figure that will help me push this channel. When I started, I just wanted to blow, you know, that kind of blow. <laughs> I'm not trying to scare anybody or frighten anybody, you know, I'm just sharing my truth. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Genika and this is Genika's Diary. I create content for Lagos State, Nigeria. So you might want to join this amazing family. Do well to hit on the red subscribe button to get subscribed and belong to this channel so guys today i'm going to be sharing things i wish i knew before starting this whole youtube journey this youtube career this youtube channel as the case may be so um a disclaimer here please this video is not in any way trying to frighten or scare anyone this is me just sharing my truth about how it has been for me or what i wish you know i had in place before i started this video might equally prepare you especially if you wish to start or you want to start and for those that are already in the game especially small youtubers you know can relate with me with the things i am going to be saying in this video so let's just get straight into it right away you know when you want to venture into something or start with something or a business or their approach you feel like you have known about that thing to an extent you feel you can do it you can handle it but along the line there are things you wish you know you knew before you started there are things you wish you had in place before you started you know and all of that that does not mean you cannot pick up and keep moving you must keep moving yeah but there are things you wish you knew before you started so this is how this whole youtube journey has been for me you know there are things i wish i had in place there are things i wish i knew before i started so the very first one is i wish i had a godfather or a godmother or a mentor before i started yes <laughs> like it would have made this journey so easier for me because you know having somebody already in the game will you know help you like give you you know that hand that speed yeah you need so um like most times i envy people that you know have a family member already have a friend or acquaintance here you know that help them push their channels share their videos shout outs and all of that you know it really helps yes so i wish i had somebody already in the game before i started it would have made this journey a lot much easier for me because you know nobody likes stress you know nobody likes stress everybody likes you know things that are easy for them yeah so i'm not saying that you cannot start from scratch and make it like a lot of people have done that of which i am doing but having somebody already in the game would have given me a bonus like to have made it so much easier for me yes so um, i'm using this opportunity to say that i want to be somebody's god doctor on this youtube because i need to have a mentor i need to have a godfather figure that will help me push this channel because what i am saying is not encouraging at all like i need somebody to help me i'm open because i am a good girl i am a good girl and i'll use the opportunity to tag my favorite youtubers bigger youtubers to help me because i need it in my life so the thing. second one is i never knew that youtube will emotionally stress me like <sighs> You know when you have put in the work creating content taking your time create content you know edit it and upload and you're not getting expected feedback you're not getting expected result like it's can it can emotionally stress you yes yeah, can emotionally stress you you feel that you're not doing enough you feel that you know you're not putting in the work whereas you know a lot of work has gone down you know and sometimes you want to compare yourself with other people you know start seeing their subscriber counts and 
number of views especially people you felt that you started to get that of which you're supposed to know that everybody is on their own no two persons you know have the same journey take your own one step at a time so if you want to let you know all those things it can emotionally stress you too. yeah but we are pushing we move <laughs> I wish I knew before starting this journey on YouTube is knowing that YouTube can financially drain somebody. Yes, YouTube can financially drain somebody if if you are not careful. It's not been. It's not about being careful. Self. This one is real life issue, especially if you are not. You're just starting up and you're not getting you know paid. You're not getting paid yet you know not getting you know something in return yet if you're not careful it can financially drain you yet if you're not careful because you know buying data in nigeria is a whole lot like it's another thing we need to sit down and discuss as nigerians because you buy data worth of 1500 naira then it's supposed to last for seven days but if you are not careful, if you are not careful, if you don't manage it, like it will not even last for three days. It will not last for three days. I don't know what this our network service providers are turning into because by the time you watch other people, you know, upload your videos, support other people, so they will support you in return. They will be sending message to you that you have exhausted your data or your data is remaining 20 MB. <laughs> I don't see six six uh, gigabytes they'll be telling you there's many 20 mb so it's it's frustrating like it can financially drain you so if you're not careful that means you'll be recharging twice in a week that is 1005 twice in a week that is 3000 naira in a week and you're not getting anything in return yet it can be draining like it can be draining but all the way i see it is i'm investing into this and you know i'm going to rip going to reap the fruit of my labor all the monies i've spent i'm spending and Next. this one is i never knew youtube is so time consuming yes as a mother you know i have business and you know have family to take care of most times you just say okay let me quickly sit down and create this content let me quickly sit down and film you know <laughs> before you sit down to film arrange your you know filming guests and all of that your setup and everything then you sit down you start filming you start filming all of a sudden you realize that you have done mistakes you start all over again before you would know what is going on you've taken hours you get or is it when you're editing you know trying to take out some content and to you know just putting clips here and there before you know it it's time consuming like you just okay let me give myself one hour to do this before you know you're taking like three four hours like it is so time consuming i never knew i never i told you something you just sit down fast 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 as you do you know before you know put everything together and upload but you get to realize that it's time consuming but what do we do you got to manage your time you know so that everything will work in place so the next thing i wish i knew before starting this whole youtube you know journey is putting out real content like when i say real i mean real content because i feel like a lot of people engage more in real in real life content yes they want to see things happening they want to you know see how it is how did you do it they want to get solutions to something you know people are searching for a lot of things and they want to see you convince them that you know this thing actually it's what it is you get so i feel like people engage more in that you know especially sometimes i watch people videos and i'll be like how can this person be so real like people sharing their their delivery you know journey delivery process and all of that showing parts of their body sharing their personal life experiences you know those real real content providing solution real solutions to problems like i am promising from now on i'm going to be keeping it hundred like real 
I'm not taking anything out of the it's real content, like real. <laughs> so guys, just stick with me and you'll be getting it hot, hot. Next thing I I wish I knew was that you know people were not going to like me or like my content. It's fine, it's fine, even in the world we live in, not everybody likes everybody, yes. <laughs> If you get what I mean, you know, yeah, so um, it's fine, you know, when you hear people say, ah, what well, your content, your content, this, your content, and I know they are telling you to put more effort, to put more work, but then tell that person you're doing well first hmm? before you start judging. Tell the person, nee, you know, you're doing well, you're trying <laughs> before you judge that person because maka blood pressure. <laughs> Maka high BP, it's your choice, so I have accepted it that no, not everybody will like me, not everybody will like my content, and it is perfectly fine. <laughs> so the last one for today, the last thing I wish I knew before I started this whole YouTube journey was not to put pressure on myself. Yes, because when I started, I just wanted to blow, you know, that kind of blow. <laughs> I just wanted to blow so the money can start coming in and all of that you know so I was putting myself on a whole lot of pressure especially when people do not and I tell people to subscribe and could not subscribe you know when I put out videos and don't get views the way I expected it to be you know I would just start disturbing myself worrying and all of that trying to meet or comparing myself with bigger people when I see their number of views or you know their subscriber counts I'll start feeling a kind of way you know and all of that so I have decided to be calming down you know like calm down and take everything one step at a time yes one step at a time I'm just you know open for friendship here genuine friendship genuine support you know you support me i support you in return watch your videos learn from people you know learn from people put in the work put in the work put out good content and you know pray to god because he only has the final say and you know yeah he only can make you what he wants you to be so yeah i know i'm not alone on this i'm not alone in this i know there are a lot of people in this so what did you wish you knew before you started your channel before you started your journey on youtube please leave a comment down below in the comment section and tell us why so guys just give this video a thumbs up as usual and share if possible i will see you guys in my next video Bye.